also closely watching what becomes of the Affordable Care Act. Nine Your Signs, Ivan Rodriguez learns what businesses are doing to prepare for what Republicans have assured will be a change. How are they going to pay for health care? How will they share the expenses with employees if indeed they share those expenses? How will they account for the premium increases that all businesses face? Michael Varney is president and CEO of the Tucson Metro Chamber of Commerce. He says after a comprehensive survey of businesses in the area, they were surprised health care was a primary concern. It's a major issue and we were surprised just how big the issue had become and how fast it had become a big issue. Varney says many businesses are having trouble paying for their employees' health insurance because the cost is so high. It's a big struggle right now. Most companies that, that we're aware of want to do right by their staff. They want to do right by their uh, employees and their families. They're trying very, very hard to do that, to maintain decent coverage, um, but just don't know what that will look like going forward. Leah Marquez-Peterson, president and CEO of the Tucson Hispanic Chamber, agrees with companies having a choice, but is skeptical of the outcome. As a Chamber of Commerce, of course, we support free market principles. However, in a healthcare environment, that's a little tough. When a hospital such as this one here and others are mandated to provide service for free to, uh, to those that show up in the emergency rooms, that's a hard thing to, to turn into a free market economy. Peterson does agree the Affordable Care Act isn't affordable for businesses. The lack of affordability for the small business community has really been top of mind. Our chamber represents over 1,800 businesses here in Arizona, and a majority of them that are small businesses are not providing any health insurance because it's simply not affordable. With no sign of when the new bill will be put to law, all businesses can do is wait. Ivan Rodriguez, KGA 9, on your side.